Director of Aquaculture and Inland Fisheries in the Ministry of Fisheries and Marine Resources, Rudy Clute, says the ministry is the way of the dead fish. He says this is as a result of the mud which flows into the lake due to the heavy rains in the area. Clute revealed that the mud blocks the gills of the fish, resulting in insufficient supply of oxygen to the species. When our news team visited the lake, we came across large quantities of dead fish. The Ministry of Fisheries and Marine Resources is on a fact-finding mission to collect samples. Although the fish can still be consumed, Clute warned residents that it is unsafe to do so now. This picture looks like the end of the world. As you can see, this fish died on a catastrophic scale and everybody is wondering why. Cape Aero Kanji, NBC News, Lake Oanap. February the 13th, 2017, a video, the recent heat wave sweeping across Australia has caused hundreds of endangered gray-headed flying foxes to die still hanging in the trees.
Disgusting. Austin Hudnall and Steven Subsack could show you where to look. It smells pretty bad down here. They're at the spot where Gray's Bay and Minnehaha Creek meet. They love to fish here when the fish are alive, not dead. Look, we got one, two, three, four, five, six. There's so many of them, it just looks like there's rocks. A fish kill here is not unusual, but this many, some say they've never seen before. <laughs> A couple hundred? I don't know, maybe more. <laughs> A lot. I feel bad because my kids like to catch the fish. The Minnehaha Creek Watershed District says essentially what happened is last year this dam was open longer than it usually is. More fish congregated in this area, then it froze over quickly. The oxygen was depleted, so the fish died. And now since it's warmed up and the ice has melted a bit, this is why we're seeing this site. Oh my God. It's something people have noticed in the past several days. For those who've come to look, they won't forget the sight. It's gonna smell bad. <laughs> that too. Until the ice melts and the water washes off this bank, Austin and Steven won't hang around here long. Oh, probably not. Ellery McCardle, Carol 11 News, Lake Minnetonka.